Please pause this video and answer the question before continuing. In this question, we want to determine what percent of the female managers have an MBA. Notice that we have a population of managers here, and there are two criteria associated with each manager. They are having or not having an MBA and being male or female. As such, we can solve this question using the double matrix method. So let's reserve the left-hand column for managers who have an MBA and the right-hand column for managers who do not have an MBA. Then we will reserve the top row for male managers and the bottom row for female managers. So our goal here is to place each of the 250 managers in one of the four boxes depending on their characteristics. First, we are told that 90 of the managers have an MBA, so the sum of these two boxes must be 90. Now, since there are 250 managers altogether and 90 of them have an MBA, we can conclude that the remaining 160 managers do not have an MBA, so the sum of these two boxes must be 160. Next, we are told that there are 100 male managers, so the sum of these two boxes must be 100. Since there are 250 managers altogether and 100 of them are male, then the remaining 150 managers must be female. So the sum of these two boxes must be 150. Now we know that there are 100 male managers altogether and we are told that 30% of them have an MBA. So we know that 30 of the male managers have an MBA. At this point we can complete the rest of the table. Since we know that these two boxes add to 100, and one box has 30 managers, then this box must have 70 managers. Next, we know that these two boxes add to 160, and one box has 70 managers, which means this box must have 90 managers. Finally, these two boxes add to 90, and one box has 30 managers, so this box must have 60 managers. Now the question asks us, what percent of the female managers have an MBA? So to find this, we need the number of female managers with an MBA and the total number of female managers. Well, there are 60 female managers with an MBA, so we can add that here. And there are 150 female managers altogether, so we can add that here. This fraction is equal to 40%, so the answer is D.